Hello everyone, welcome back to Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. Let's get back into our career and see what we got going on there. I think for now I wanna do a couple more um, normal races and uh, in maybe next week or so we're gonna do some cop races. Uh, Empower is gonna be a gauntlet. I can't remember what a gauntlet race is actually, but we'll we'll find out soon enough Built for track. so the m3 is what we're driving here beat the part times to earn medals oh it's basically i it it's it's like a timed race but with cops they're trying to slow me down So let's drift our way around this corner right here. That's, that's what the M3 does best. In real life too, it, it's a real drift machine. Oh god damn, I, I thought I was gonna hit that car, but I missed. And that slowed me down way too much. Don't you dare prevent me from taking the shortcut. I almost did it, but he couldn't quite finish the job there. He's coming closer. Oh, I, I have spike strips, uh, spike strips this race. I thought I had... Uh, I thought I had EMPs. I think some of them have EMPs though. He's done for. Why am I behind that cop now? He's not done. Now he is. I, th I thought he crashed into that um, AI car, but he didn't. Gonna need emergency services, yeah? Of course. Do you think they're gonna be taking me down with like two regular cop cars? No, sir. Let's take the shortcut. It should actually be faster. Oh no. That was bad. Now it's certainly not faster than going than going on the road. Unless I would have crashed there as well, but probably wouldn't. Not because I'm good, but because it's just easier to, to stay on the road. Then. I'm not gonna reach this goal in time. Uh, I'm gonna try again though, I wanna get the gold medal. Yes, I'm sorry, it, it was really close to the finish line, but I made a couple of uh, mistakes that I shouldn't have made, and they cost me the gold medal. Also, I don't know, like if you. You saw that when I took it the first cup. It spawned me behind the other one, even though before I destroyed the first one, I was ahead of both of them. So maybe it, it, it kind of reset me a little bit as well and cost me time that way? I, I don't know. I don't know. I can't confirm or deny that. Let's not be stupid here again. Thank you, game. Thank you. That was... Honestly, I'm gonna restart right away before just uh, complaining later on when I won't make it. But that was like, it, it focused on the cop, wouldn't let me move. And then and then when I was able to take control again, I was already in, in that AI car. 
that was that was bullshit. If those things happen. It's 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 an EA game after all. But still. the same shit gonna happen again? Please no. Uh, that was actually worse. <laughs> that, that, that was partly my fault though. Oh. I gotta do this race though, there's no other like non-police races available available at the moment. to the other side, like that. Okay, that's how you do it. I actually hit top speed there. The M3 is top speed in this game is like 294. Yeah, going over 300 again here, god damn. Which of course is only possible with nitrous. Hit one. Nailed it, you could say. Take some damage there, but so am I. Suspect is driving aggressively, yeah, and what about you then? I'm just I'm just driving man, you, you guys are just trying to stop me for no reason. I got an M3 I'm, my car is probably faster than yours. So like why would you stop driving me? Or why would you st stop me from uh, from driving? I'm not doing a, an illegal thing. Driving a car. Yes, I'm going above the speed limit, but you know, you gotta catch me first. What? I thought that was. That car looked so black, I thought it was a cop car. Let's destroy this guy. Thank you. Destroy the other one as well. Yep, he's down. Am I gonna make it this time? Yeah, I am. There's no way I'm not unless there's another AI spawning right in front of me. Nope. We did it! Yes! Awesome! It, was, it wasn't the... It, it was only the first race of this kind. Oh, and we actually leveled up or got enough experience so that we can now drive supercars. That's awesome. Uh, this one? Yeah. That's gonna be a race with cops. Hmm. 19.8 kilometers as well. That's a Corvette. There's a Porsche Turbo S. And an R8 Spider. A DVS one. Viper? Huh, final edition, sure. In 2010. Um, what do we take here?
The Gallardo would be cool. But let's take the Viper. I don't think it's gonna be the, the best choice for handling, but in a straight line it should be extremely potent. And given that this is Need for Speed and you can uh, you can drift around corners at ridiculous speeds, what, what really matters is how much speed you can build up on a straight. And in that regard, the Viper is actually really good. See? It's gonna be the first cup. It's a DBS. Looks like there's a race in progress here. I'm gonna try to shut it down. Central requesting permission to launch an EMP. So I hit that guy with the spike strip. Spike strip online. And that R8 is just so fast and much faster around the corners, obviously. Although immediately after I said that, I I made up a lot of. Uh, Last time around that corner, for some reason, because he went so wide. Central requesting permission to release a spike strip. Confirmed. Spike There's another cop, which I did hit that time. So it worked this time. No need to worry about. And then we'll take him right here, because we still got plenty of distance left in this race. Jam the police systems. What? I thought that was going to be a takedown. Now I get points for crash escape, excuse me? I didn't escape the crash. <laughs> You're gonna love this game sometimes. And it's all in the sense for logic. Or rather, lack thereof. I'm gonna take down that car. Everybody got caught in it though. Except for the one who just spawned further ahead. Again, you gotta love this game. For stuff like that. Monitoring spike strip release in your area, proceed with caution. I did not hit anyone with that spike strip, unfortunately. Just gonna farm my EMP on him. He's just gonna continue driving like nothing happened after I hit him with an EMP. Yeah, right. We got seven point well seven kilometers left basically. And we're in the lead right now. So that's good. All units, weapon systems are down, A Porsche Panamera Turbo Cop car, that's gonna be a tough one to shake off. Level 2 spike strip. Um, I don't even see that guy, but. Air support is heading up. He should be there shortly. I'm only 1.4 seconds out of second place now. Oh, and there's that guy now. The 
helicopter. I wanted to lock it at the... Uh, onto the helicopter. No one spike strip? Wait. He's down. And of course I I, I keep going straight on after that freaking sequence. Got him. Would be nice if you know when they are doing the camera switch if my car would at least follow the course in the meantime. Instead of uh, going straight on when, when we're actually approaching the corner. And we're done with this. Again, at the very end of every gauntlet race or every um, hot pursuit, there's a, road, a roadblock just after the finish line. So it looks cool when you pass through. Um, right. We got a new car. Oh yeah, a Lamborghini Gallardo. Always different, always Lamborghini. I'm not so sure if I agree with that since they're since they're owned by Audi, but you know that's another question for another day. Okay, that's gonna be a duel. And we are in the Shelby. Let's take the light blue. We're up against a Lamborghini though. And I'm not sure how my chances are in this in this event. Because Lamborghinis are just always really tough to beat. And this is the 20 kilometers race. There actually is um, vehicle damage in this event, it seems, so uh, I could destroy him. But uh, without, without stuff like EMPs or spike strips, which are not available in this event, it's going to be pretty tough. To the point where I'm going to say it's almost impossible. Okay, so let's try and outrun him then. Gonna try and drift neatly through here. He's gonna grab the inside line though. Man, parallel drifting between a Lamborghini Gallardo and a Shelby GT500. That's the. That just looks awesome, man. It's, for that reason, I, I almost rather have him up front so I can see him as well doing his thing, but. You know, I want to win, <laughs> so I don't, I don't want to let him pass. He drove through the pseudo shortcut. I don't know if that was actually faster. Side by side, neck and neck. Oh, bad driving there. Taking up for it right here though. Don't make me go off road, thank you. Not there. Man, this is... This is going back and forth, as I expected it to, because the, the Lambo is uh, pretty much the better car here. So I gotta make up for it by being the, the better driver, although I don't know how reliably I can do that. <laughs> oh, don't hit that, thank you. Look, 
He's just so much faster through the corners. Take him on his straights. Let him not drift through here. Expect that corner to be so tight. I'm gonna go for the shortcut like 100% because if he doesn't, then that wins me the race. And he doesn't, so GG pretty much. Unless I make a terrible mistake. Yeah, there's of course the very real thing of rubber banding in this game, which means that if somebody drops very far behind, we're gonna get sped up. And uh, that's the only thing I'm really a little bit concerned about right now. One kilometer to the finish line. And there it is. Crossing the finish line at like 336 or something? God damn. Nice. We got a new car again. A Porsche Targa S. Targa 4S. Well, I, I don't think there's any performance events left now, any new ones. We can of course redo the old ones, but I don't think I want to do that right now. Because we... I got the gold medal on all events, so I don't see a reason to do some um, some events again. Uh, this is going to be a preview event. A Lamborghini Reventon. God damn, that's, that's a spaceship for the road. That's what that is. Um, yeah, so this is going to be awesome. And of course, this being used for Speed Hot Pursuit, we're going to be drifting all the way through here. this 360 degree like highway ramp or whatever this is and come out of it alive in a Lamborghini I mean fuck realism basically is what this game says but you gotta love it for that The second one properly as, as well. These two drifts are really probably like the the key to success in, in this race. And then also not losing as much speed as I did right there in that uh, tight left corner that comes afterwards. 
but I'm gonna make it on time easily. And there we go. First try, five over five seconds uh, over five seconds under the reference time. So well done. What else do we got? Stampede, Hot Pursuit, Super Series. Mm -hmm. And that is a time trial. Sure. Let's do this. Okay, so there's only these two options, one of which I have not unlocked, so... Gonna go with the DPS Volante then. Sure, let's take this kind of mint green. I've always liked Aston Martins in like mint green color. They're, they're extremely rare though. Like you, you barely ever see an Aston Martin and if you do it's usually in like British racing green or maybe black or white sometimes but never in this color. Far from ideal, but didn't lose too much speed, thankfully. Oh, yeah. That was bad. It's gonna cost us a lot of time down this straight. Almost 340 right there. God damn, that's. Fa oh my god. That was bad. That probably lost me a lot of time. Can I still make it? Yeah, I'm still gonna make it. Well, it wasn't. It, it didn't lose me like a lot of time in the sense of. I don't know, three or four seconds, more like half a second perhaps. Which can be a lot if we're talking about short courses like this. Nice. It wasn't a perfect run, but it did the job. And we leveled up again, which means we're gonna get a new wanted level and presumably a new car as well. Felon, wanted level six. Okay. Yup, new car. What do we get this time? A Ford GT. Well, the pace car for an entire company. Yeah, it's also pretty much the only supercar for this producing. Uh, do we do this as well? 18.3 kilometers. Yeah, sure. Let's give it, a, give it a try. Equipment available at Turbo. The cops are on to us at every level, but there is one area where they can't match us. Speed. Your cars are being fitted with the latest speed enhancement, the turbo system. Activate the turbo, and within seconds, the system will engage and give your car a rocket-powered kick of acceleration and speed. The system is very volatile, so you can only attempt a limited number of launches during the race. Good luck. Okay, so... Stampede, stampede is what exactly? Okay, we can use this one for Grab it in yellow. Because yellow Lamborghinis are just awesome. We have two jammers and three turbos. Only two jammers on 18 kilometers. I'm probably gonna get hit by one or two EMPs as a result. And that sucks. Oh man. 
There were three roadblocks. I didn't even realize we were at level two roadblocks already. I must have missed those. He did not hit anything bad at all. I thought I could make it past that. Turbo is still not charged up. How long do you take, Turbo? Come on. You can do it. Oh, he had a crash, so I'm back in front. And just after I take the lead, I get the turbo. Let's use it. It doesn't actually... Like, when you're close to top speed, it doesn't actually do that much anymore. So you gotta use it when you're slowed down, like after you had an accident or something. Got it. Okay, that could have gone worse. Turbo boost available. The Super Lechero Cop. There hasn't been a single EMP usage yet by any of those cops. And we've been... We, we've already done half of this race, so... Actually, two jams might be enough. He also went through the shortcut. Spin him out. There's a roadblock. He's down for. I'm just gonna escape real quick. God damn it. And I'm behind again. Oh man, don't hit that. Thank you. All units heads up, I'm gonna disable his car. Officer, please proceed with caution. Three kilometers left, we can do this. We can do this. Don't do me dirty and, and drop a spike strip now. He's gonna do it. He dropped two in a row, but uh, luckily I was able to avoid them. And that really was pretty much luck. Because it came down to where he dropped them. I wasn't there. Okay, nice. Three fifty three fifty three, and we unlocked something new. Another new car. A, G a GT five hundred Super Snake in the Super Series. Okay, we've driven that before. Seven hundred fifty horsepower Shelby Hot Rod. Yeah, it's a cool car. So uh, looking forward to having the possibility of driving that presumably next time hope you guys enjoyed this episode leave a like or a comment if you did thanks for watching i'll see you next time